Hi, Gemini. Welcome to your reading. This reading is meant to bring you confirmations of the things you already intuitively know and sense about the person and the connection you have with them. We are doing uh, in separation a dialogue of the energies between us. Divine masculine, divine feminine dialogue. Uh, if this reading does not resonate for you, you can check out your other sun positions, your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Sometimes the 8th and 7th house signs will resonate. And if you are having a love affair that seems to be fizzling or waning out, a uh, 5th house sign may resonate for you. Let's jump in. Let's find the energies. I'm going to pull energies between the two of you both sides of the energy then what is the unspoken energy in the middle between us what do we have in lightness between us how are we aligned and remember guys sometimes when separation happens it can be physical emotional or mental you could be sitting in the same room with each other and feel like you're a million miles apart and you never have anything to say to each other let's find out what we're saying on the energetic level First person's energy. We've got karmic love. This love is too painful to keep holding on. Second person's energy. Secret admirer. I'm not ready to reveal my true feelings to you. Energies going on between us. What's in likeness between us? Manifesting. I'm manifesting loving and meaningful relationships. Hoping for loving and meaningful relationships. So right now we've got someone that is like, I can't keep holding on. This is hurting. Someone over here that just does not know how to express and doesn't have the courage to express and step into the fact that we are in likeness with each other of wanting to manifest loving and meaningful relationship. Feels like we're out of alignment, but in actuality, on the energetic level, we're not. The block's coming from over here of, I can't express my love. It's uncomfortable. I can't tell you my truer, deeper thoughts and feelings. Let's come in over here on this person with the, I am hurting. I'm going to take everything I learned here and transform it into something else, something higher. So this person over here in this energy is like, I love you, but I can't, I can't, I can't keep waiting. I can't. It's this hurting. So they are on the verge of trying to make a decision uh, to move on or keep trying. Come in over here on seek the secret. I don't know how to tell you. Mm. Okay, we're getting two on it. What would love do in this situation? Love would just love. I wish we we could and would choose each other and show each other a higher love that is unconditional, different, not constrictive, and tr truly freeing. Yeah, this person is like, they want to, they want to badly express it in a different way but something is holding them back energy between us let's see what's in lightness there see anything in lightness can we talk from the middle please bring it together there it goes i forgive you I forgive me. I forgive all. Let's move forward in some manner from the past. Yeah. God definitely. Both of us know. Both of us are in alignment on that one. Hopefully, guys, that is enough to give you enough confirmation. Is this your reading or not? Uh, and like I said, if it's not, check out the other sign positions. Let's get the dialogue. The energy's going Gemini's. Woo. Everyone has baggage, including me. I'm working on it. Talk. Keep talk. There we go. I'm waiting for the right time. <clears throat>
I sometimes felt unappreciated, taken for granted by you. I should have walked away many times and for good, but I didn't. I do miss you. Miss your touch. Oh, I keep pulling this one. I'm hiding the way I truly feel. Some days are easier than others, but I feel like you're still there somewhere. <clears throat> I'm sorry I was mean to you. It's a defense mechanism. I know you're with others. I don't like it, but I've learned to accept it for now. I can't be with you right now, but I will be back for you. I will. I realize I was selfish. I feel ashamed of that. You hurt me. I probably hurt you. I'm not mad. Forgiveness and understanding are key. I want to return to you. I do. I just want things to be different with us when I do. I feel like you don't care. I feel heartbroken. Don't think I don't care. I do. I just feel stuck right now. It's important for me to stay grounded and balanced no matter what is going on. I sometimes regret having told you how I feel about you. I should have hidden my feelings from you. <clears throat> I sometimes feel intimidated by you. Am I good enough for you? I have to focus on money and financial stability right now. The way we triggered each other felt too painful and I didn't understand at the time. I wasn't expecting this connection when it showed up. Even though I knew what it was right away, I wasn't ready. No one hasn't helped made it e made it easier. I must trust in divine timing. I wasn't looking for anything like this. 
but I surrendered to it rather than run. I wanted to run, but I didn't. Memories of us still linger even after all this time. about being able to come up to your expectations. Sometimes we make things harder than they need to be. I'm open and approachable. How are you? Are you approachable? Guys, we're getting <laughs> a little bit angry at each other here. Oh, Pop. I wanted to run, but I didn't. I tried to make healthy boundaries, but I feel like you didn't understand. My heart is still open to you. I wasn't ready for anything like this. I'm not sure I deserve the way you love me. A lot of big changes have happened. I'm trying to figure things out. I wasn't sure how my life would change if we continued the connection. Please have patience. It may not seem so, but I'm getting it slowly, but I am. I feel like we don't have a solid foundation. I'm losing patience with this. I'm ready to move on. I long for you still, and sometimes I cry over the loss of you, of us. Was there even an us, or was that just my imagination? I'm afraid of getting addicted to you, lost in you. I want to make things right between us. I'm not sure how to do that. I'm working on it. I didn't think I could be what you needed or wanted me to be. I'm not sure how to best approach you. I'm thinking about it.
I feel like this is fate. I feel like we have known each other before. I feel like we are supposed to be together. I have options and opportunities, but I still don't want anyone else. No one else is you. Geminis, I hope it was helpful. Y'all stay blessed.